Today we are going to be making a collage. A collage is a fancy art word for ripping paper and gluing it down to another paper. So the first thing you're going to do is take your glue brush, dab it on the lip if you got too much, not the lips on your face, and then you're going to take a little section of your paper and spread some glue. Then you can take your tissue paper, give it a little rip, and dab it on your paper. It's okay if your hands get a little gluey. We'll just wait until the end and we can wash them off then. Or you can even just rub your fingers together and get some of that glue off if it's bothering you. done but I noticed I had a little empty spots over here so I'm going to go ahead and add a little more glue and I'm going to add some more tissue paper and glue it down I want my paper to be almost all the way covered if possible and it's okay to overlap because the tissue paper is thin it'll show through and it's also okay to crinkle paper and now I'm just going to do my gluey magic trick where I rub my hands together to get all the little glue off perfect now I'm gonna take this over to the drying rack. Now we're going to make two mittens by tracing our two hands. I'm gonna start by tracing my left hand with my Sharpie, and I don't want it to get too close to my hand because I want it to feel like a mitten. So I'm gonna go outside, make a big loop over my fingers, and then a big loop over my thumb. And it's gonna be nice and fat. Now I'm going to make a mitten on this hand. This hand is tricky because I'm right-handed. So you can go really slow. Now what you're going to do is make some designs on your mitten with your Sharpie. I'm going to use my oil pastels to color them in. If you have an oil pastel like this one that's dirty, you can clean it because we're going to cut these out so you can actually just kind of scribble scrabble and get that off before you go into coloring. Okay, um, so I admit while I was coloring these, I wasn't always super happy with them. Um, but sometimes you just got to keep working on it until you like it and just kind of, you know what, just keep going with it even if it's not the best thing you've ever made. Just kind of be a good sport about it and have a good sense of humor and just see what you can do. See if you can make it work. So now I'm going to take my scissors and cut these out and I'm going to go super slow like a sloth because I want to make sure that I'm looking with my eyes out the line and so that I don't accidentally cut through my gloves. All right, now we're back to gluing. We're going to dip our glue brush in the glue, wipe it on the lip, and then you're going to rub it on the back of your glove. And then we'll just press those straight down to our collaged paper. Now I've got two mittens playing out in the snow. Make sure you can still see your name if you can't. Go ahead and take a minute to write your name on the back. And we'll put it in the drying rack to dry. Mm -hmm. 